hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here. And we are starting a new series. It's a short series by Oscar M1258. Green Greens Remade. This is, well, a Mega Man Maker version remake of Kirby's Dream Land. So Kirby's Dream Land is a game that... Uh, game I grew up with. I, I have a I have a story about it. So when I was a kid, uh, I had a Game Boy, original Game Boy, had like a dozen or so games for it, and uh, over the summer, me and my family would like live on a boat. And like one time like I left my Game Boy there because I wasn't going to be playing it uh, over the weekend. And, oh, we need Flappy Beat. That is our Kirby flying power. Okay. Oh, and these are supposed to be the Warp Stars, I take it? No, not the Warp Stars. This isn't the Warp Star. This is the uh, bonus room. Where you get, you know, a max tomato. I don't know, will one up? Do you normally get a one up there? I don't know. Uh, this is the Warp Star. Okay, so yellow is the Warp Star. Bomb Man, the mini boss. We'd normally fight the Bomber Boy. Get a health pickup, and then we're into woods. Alrighty. Uh, anyways, so my Game Boy and all my stuff was, was stolen, and, like, I, I don't know what happened with, like, insurance money or, or whatever. We, we had, like, lots of people break into the, the marina, the particular marina we were at, and, and steal stuff. Like, we would have our TVs, like, just a small TV. Um, it wasn't a huge boat or anything. Uh, but, like, that would get stolen. Radios. So we had to, like, take all that stuff uh, off of the boat, like, every single weekend when we left or, or whatever. <laughs> oh my gosh, Wispy Woods. Oh, I love it. And true to Wispy Woods nature, I can just kind of wail on him and not have to worry about dodging too much. <laughs> I love that Wispy Woods. Uh, so anyways, one of the games that got stolen was Kirby's Dream Land 2. And I really liked that game, and I wanted it back. So like that year, I put it on my Christmas list. That was really short. We're going to have to do the next stage in the series as well, then. Uh, so I put it on my Christmas list, and my parents ended up getting me Kirby's Dream Land, not Kirby's Dream Land 2, and they're like, well, that's the same thing, right? Because, you know, they didn't really care about the, the... It wasn't the first or only time that sort of situation happened. Like, I wanted... Dragon Warrior Monsters, and they got me Dragon Warrior 1 and 2, and they're like, well, it says Dragon Warrior in the name, so it's the same thing, right? No. No, it's not. Castle Lolo Lo. -lo, -lo. Alright, I'll be interested to see how we handle the, uh, boss fight here. So I could go up, or I could go this way. I'm gonna go this way. I think up was the bonus, but whatever. Ah, uh, I forgot my way around this castle. I could maybe even play Kirby's Dream Land for, uh, for the channel. But yeah, they got me Kirby's Dream Land. I was, naturally, as like a seven, eight-year-old kid, very disappointed in that. And... But they're like, well, that's the game we got you, so that's what you're getting anyways. Um, what's the point of... Oh, so that's the that's the 
pop star. Why are there... That's confusing. That's the only tough one. And then that opens up? Okay. Sure. The infinite roll. That's... That's gotta be difficult to pull off. Okay, let's... Flappy beat. Puff our way up here. Hey, there's a uh, easy E. Yeah, I'm sure I've been missing other goodies, but whatever. Ah, uh, this is a pretty good recreation of the Kirby's Dreamland castle. Really, really, Flappy Beat. Ah! The enemies are mostly not super difficult. Most of the regular enemies in Kirby was, were not difficult to begin with, either. Uh, my favorite Kirby game... Oh, this is what we're doing. This is kind of a lot. I need to get that before I die to all of these bubble mans. So yeah, it's supposed to be like they push the block through the door and you have to like maneuver your way to not be around them. I, I get the I get the uh, sense with the bubble man here. Oh, these two are gonna be Tricky. Yeah, maybe not. All right, there we go. A couple of them took a lot more damage. I, I don't understand why, but... Okay, so I guess that's how we're handling that boss fight. So yeah, pretty good uh, recreation of Stage 2 of Kirby's Dream Land, so I'll give that a thumbs up. I know on this channel, we've talked a lot about replicas versus remakes and doing something different, but this is taking a stage from, like, an entirely different franchise and incorporating that into Mega Maker. So I, I think those... Those I'm not going to be as strict about the whole replica versus remake, and, and I, I am more interested in seeing, like, sort of the replica version of that. So, for now, I'll take my leave.